Hi, I'm Dave Brubaker, product line manager for the AMD Xilinx Zinc Ultra Scale Plus RFSOC products. Today I'm at Mobile World Congress Las Vegas and we're going to demonstrate a partner ORAN front hall reference design on the Zinc RFSOC DFE, DFE for digital front end. The RFSOC DFE is our latest product that integrates key radio IP in a hardened format such as crest factor reduction, digital pre-distortion, and lo-fi functions in an AT8R configuration, providing cost-effective solutions for massive MIMO and ORAN radios, or ORUs. The RFSOC DFE is available on a ZCU670 evaluation kit that RFDSP used to create the front hall reference design from their own IP and AMD Xilinx IP. Let's take a look at the demonstration setup for today. Here in the center, we have the ZCU670 RF evaluation platform, and on that board, we have the RFSOC DFE ZU67DR device. The ZU67DR device is an 8x8 configuration, which includes not only the hard DFE IP, but also the RFDSP ORAN reference design. In addition to the ZCU670, we have an XM655 board that plugs on and has low, mid, and high output frequencies. Today we're going to be doing the test at a lower RF frequency to enable the maximum signal dynamic range without post amplification, which is typical of regular implementations. Over here we have the Viavi TM500 ODU emulator, which is connected to the ZCU670 with a 25 gig ethernet cable. The TM500 is used to send pre-configured 3GP compliant downlink data, user and control plane information to the ZCU670. In addition, the TM500 captures uplink data from the 670 and then passes that data onto the BSA software for analysis. On the RF side, we use Rodian Schwartz test equipment. The downlink data that's actually generated in the TMM500 and then passed to the ZCU670 is fed from there into the Rodian Schwartz spectrum analyzer where we can actually characterize the signal quality to 3GPP metrics. The uplink data is generated in the SM100A device fed to the ZCU670 and then subsequently through the 25 gig front hall interface to the TMM500. From there, the user data is passed to the VSE software where we can complete signal analytics. The RFDSP ORU reference design is an AT8R 7.2x split, which includes the front hall, lo-fi, and DFE uh, reference design. It supports C, U, and S traffic and provides an API for implant traffic. It has also been optimized for the hard IP in the RFSOC DFE and comes with its own software development environment, or SDE, to aid customers in product development and testing. Now that we've talked about the RFSOC DFE, we've talked about the RF DSP ORU reference design, and we've talked about the entire test setup, Let's actually take a look at some actual downlink data to show the overall system working together. Now remember that the downlink data is created in the Viavi ODU emulator and then passed to the RFSOC via the 25 gig ethernet cable. In this case, we have the uh, reference design by RFDSP configured for a 4T, 4R, 100 megahertz radio and transmitting at 1.9 gigahertz. That output is actually then uh, passed over here to the Roden Schwartz signal analyzer and you can see by looking at the screen we're achieving excellent EVM of 0.77 percent versus a requirement of about 4.5 percent. This shows the excellent signal fidelity of the RFSOC DFE and that the entire reference design is working correctly by accepting the control and user plane packets and then transmitting the proper signal. Now let's take a look at the uplink data. Now in this case, the uplink data is actually created in the SMM100A Radiant Schwartz signal generator and then fed at 1.9 gigahertz into the RFSOC here. And the RFSOC then uses the hard IP and down converts it where the RFDSP reference design then takes that data along with control plane data and passes it back to the TM500. From there, it's actually passed to the PC, and we actually complete the signal analysis with the Rodian Schwartz VSA software. You can see on your screen that the RF performance and EVM of the uplink channel is about the same as the downlink channel, also demonstrating that the ORAN reference design is working and that the signal characteristics of the RFSOC DFE are excellent.
In this short demonstration, we've shown our partners, RFDSP's 7.2X full ORAN solution operating on the RFSOC DFE. For more information on the RFSOC DFE, please contact your local Xilinx sales representative or go to www.xilinx.com forward slash RFSOC.